Former Governor Zell Miller was retiring from public life as he battles Parkinson's. We're now getting insight into new research into Parkinson's with a local neurologist. Channel 2's Linda Stouffer has how one patient is helping fight for a cure. A few times a week, you'll find Don walking into this gym in Jasper. If it's medicine, if it's exercise, if it's movement, I'm going to do whatever it takes. I'm a fighter and I'm, a, I'm not going to give up. Never giving up in his fight with Parkinson's disease. He and his wife Marie spotted changes in his movement. And he said, um, get on your phone and see if you can Google Parkinson's disease. My heart stopped. At first, you know, just reacting, and then I got mad, and then we got active. At Emory University, Don's doctor, Stuart Factor, is on the front lines of research. And I think in the next five to ten years, you're really going to see an explosion of new directions of therapy. Dr. Stewart says they're learning how to put the brakes on the range of symptoms with a degenerative brain disorder. There is some data to suggest that um, exercise can slow progression of disease. And, and it's not just exercise, you need to stay mentally active too. Let you know that you're not alone. Don and Marie say they're praying for Governor Miller and fighting for a cure. Raising money for the Parkinson's Foundation with the Moving Day Walk this weekend. When you have to deal with a uh, an incurable situation like that, to have someone like Marie by your side is incredible and almost indescribable. The love that bursts from my heart from for Don is like the most incredible thing, and part of it is his strength. He's a fighter. He's never given up. I'm a fighter. We're never giving up together. Linda Stouffer, Channel 2 Action News.